This should have been a respectable and dignified confirmation process. In a previous year, this highly qualified nominee would have received unanimous support in the Senate. Before left-wing outside groups and Democratic leaders had him in their sights, Judge Kavanaugh possessed an impeccable reputation and was held in high esteem by the bench and the bar alike. We had a campaign of distraction from his outstanding qualifications, a campaign of destruction of this fine individual. What we have learned is the resistance that has existed since the day after the November 16, 2016 election is centered right here on Capitol Hill. They have encouraged mob rule. I hope we can say no to mob rule by voting to confirm Judge Kavanaugh. I yield the floor. Never before have we had a Supreme Court nominee where over 90% of his record has been hidden from the public and the Senate. Never before have we had a nominee display such flagrant partisanship and open hostility at a hearing. And never before have we had a nominee facing allegations of sexual assault. We're here to determine whether Judge Kavanaugh has demonstrated the impartiality, the temperament, the even-handedness that's needed to serve on this great high court of our land. If confirmed, he will join eight other individuals who are charged with deciding how the laws of our land are interpreted and applied. He would be a deciding vote on the most important issues affecting our country and every American for generations to come. Mr. President, Madam President, based on all the factors we have before us, I do not believe Judge Kavanaugh has earned this seat. 